This screencast is to show you how to download the offline textbook reader to your Chromebook. So your teacher should have shared a link to you that looks something like this. This one is a link to the Space and Earth Science textbook. If you're taking biology, you'll have a link to the biology textbook. So we want to get this textbook onto your Chromebook so you can use it whether you're connected or not connected to a wireless network. So to do so, we need to activate what's called the offline reader. So if you scroll down to the left-hand side over here, and you'll see right here it says offline reader. Go ahead and select that. Once this window pops up, you want to go ahead and open the reader. Now the next thing you might have to do once you get started and click on get started is to sign in with your Chrome account. So I'll sign in with my Chrome account. So it leads me now to the textbook that looks like this. The first thing I want to do is I want to download the full textbook. So I'm going to select this orange button. And because it is a large file, it'll take a moment. So once you have your textbook downloaded, the next step is to come right up here and select this text box that you see on the screen. You want to click on it and grab it and drag it to your bookmarks bar and release it onto the bar. So now what we've done is we created a bookmark. But you'll notice it says Flexbook Web Reader. Well, what is that? I don't remember what that is if I look at it down the road. So we're going to edit the name of this bookmark, and we can do that a couple of different ways. We can do a control and a single click on the trackpad, or just right on the trackpad, you can do a two-finger click. When we, have that, when we have this window that opens, you want to select Edit, and then here is where you can rename this bookmark. So I'm going to call it the Space and Earth Textbook and then save that, okay? So let me show you a couple things of what this looks like. Now again, you can use this whether you're online. So right now I can go in, I select this. So it takes me to my library. So the next time you use this, this is what you'll see. You'll select the textbook from your library. Here's the textbook. You scroll down and here's all the different chapters. So if I choose Chapter one, nature of science. Here's the subsections of the chapters. If I choose scientific models, here is that section on scientific models. Now, I'm connected to the internet, so this is what it looks like. So all these links you see in here, like for videos, are active because you're online. Now, let's say I decide to view this at home and I don't have internet access. So let me turn off the Wi-Fi so you can see what that looks like as well. So I'll turn this off. So you can see now Wi-Fi has been disabled. I'm gonna go back to my Chrome browser. So here's a new browser window. I am gonna select the Space and Earth textbook. It opens up to my library. I can click on that. It takes me to the section that you saw earlier, but I can go back to the whole textbook. And then if I scroll down, here's all again, the sections of the textbook. I can go on to another chapter to another section of a chapter and read that section and have the information. Now, of course, the links like to a video here is not gonna work because I'm not connected to wireless. But that's how you use the offline reader for the Space and Earth or Biology textbook.